All right, guys and gals, welcome back to some plans for zombies. We'll load it up again. Also, in addition to the Markiplier zombie, I made a Jacksepticeye zombie. I'll let you guys know, see that. Uh, before we begin, yeah. Also, posted that on my Facebook, so don't worry, you'll see it. Um, so let's go. Finally, let's get started because why not? Okay. Now, there are supposed to be cheat codes to this game, like after you beat it or some shit, I don't know. But I've never been able to get the cheat codes to work. They told me everything, you know, I tried literally, literally everything. And by everything, I mean I've literally uh, tried everything. I've tried, um... Lowercase, uppercase, the way it, that they said, you know, capitals and lowercases and numbers and whatever else. But that never worked. <laughs> oh shit! God damn it! Exploding people. So, anyways, this game is basically a tower defense game in a way, also a strategy kind of game, where. Now you gotta defend your house from zombies with plants. Weird ass game, but hey, it's awesome. Yeah, you could have some good things. I've played this on the PS3, I've played this on, um, not necessarily the, the Kindle, I've played it on a tablet before. It's okay. Now with the PS3 version, it's different. It's the same game, but it is different in that you don't know. I mean, they cover all this up with bushes and stuff, so you don't know. It, it adds a little bit more challenge, so you don't know where zombies are coming from. Um, so therefore, it's pretty good. It's, it's actually better in that aspect. Uh, also, I should mention something else. There are some versions of the game, and there are some, not all the versions, um, but some of the versions of the game, they have a Michael Jackson zombie, and others they don't. I find that weird, but yeah. Now obviously this game is unrealistic, there's no way you could kill a zombie with peas. Unless you just, unless it's like the heaviest pee you've ever goddamn seen. Now with the watermelon, it's possible. And some other plants you're gonna be seeing in this game. It's entirely possible um, that you could kill a zombie with those, because the heavier the object, the more likely you are to kill it. So yeah, there's that. But in essence, it's more so not realistic. <laughs> but, despite that, it's a really good game. I like it. And you can see the progress you've made uh, and that you are at right now. Down below, at the lower right of your screen, right there. And the brain with the flag, you are going to be seeing some epic shit. A huge wave of zombies is approaching. Yay. <laughs> this is early game shit, so yeah. Hey, you got the Markiplier zombie right there. So the Zombitar, you know, the zombie avatar does not serve as just, you know, something you could put, you know, on uh, for your Facebook status, your Twitter updates, or whatever. It actually serves a purpose, which the purpose being, um, the avatar will also be the zombie with the flag, as you've just seen. So, yeah, it's... Oh, coneheads. Oh, I hate those things. <laughs> so, yeah, basically, it's not only a tower defense game, but which is... I, I love tower defense games. I love every sort of video game. 
that I've ever played. Um, even if a lot of people call some of these kind of games bad, I love them. Um, so yeah, come on, yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Come on, sunflowers, I need to plant, I need to plant another one of you. I can't rely on just daylight. There we go. So, early on, it's probably better to have one of each, like a row of sunflower plants, uh, a row of pea shooters, maybe two rows of pea shooters. But as the game gets more progressive and aggressive, um, most likely you're going to need two, maybe three rows of each plant if you can survive that that uh, far. Ah, yes. This game brings back so much memories. I like this game. <laughs> it's like wearing pants on the holidays, you know? I don't know where I was going with that, but I don't give a fuck. I am insane. Crazy. Even DJ knows that. Hey, Conehead. Now these things, they take more hits because they got a Conehead. You know, they're protecting themselves, you know, from, uh, you know, from these attacks. Also, I do believe on the PS3 version, it's automatic, you automatically collect, you don't have to click on anything. I think you automatically just, like, hover over the, the sun, uh, you know, hover over that and you automatically collect it, I think. It's been a while since I played the PS3 version, because my PS3 has been having issues, and I don't know if I have it installed right now. But if I do, yay. <laughs> but get that cherry bomb, and let's see some shit explode. Ooh, yeah! Basically a one-hit carry and everything. Oh, we got a cone head over there. So, three rows of peas, shooters going on. Yeah, let's let's make it four rows. Get this shit going down faster. Now, I, I uh, this is like early game, so yeah. Now, uh, the zombies can also eat your plants. So that's an issue. And, uh, yeah. That, that's an incredible fucking issue. <laughs> because, yeah. That's why you need to strategize and all that. You just gotta strategize everything about this game. Now, after, um, this level, that will be it for this part. Now, let's just block that zombie. Keep him busy for a while. Well, uh... Ah. Uh, yeah, well, he get plants going. And... Uh-oh! Holy penis. Okay. The more zombies that- Oh shit, yeah, the, like I said, they can eat your plants and make it a wasted effort. <laughs> That's why you need some like walnuts to make it um, really, yeah, really hard for the zombies to penetrate your defenses. I'm playing it smart, I'm just waiting and seeing where all- Oh, yep, zombies come from there. And you also, sometimes, in some- Ah, oh, shit! In some cases, have to act fast. And you can't just, you know... It's not like- Oh, I- there, I guess there's a cheat code. Again, I've never been able to use cheat code because uh, I've, I've tried. Um... 
but cheat code, there is a cheat code that basically allows you to have, in essence, uh, unlimited sun and unlimited charging time. So it's like, after you, let's say, use a pea shooter, you can instantaneously plant another pea shooter within a split second. No time at all. So, yeah, there is a way to, I guess, cheat the game. Because they, they even tell you how to do so later on. But the thing is, I've never, like I said, never been able to do so. So, uh, if I'm lucky, I can and probably, it, it has, probably has to be, like, once you 100% the game, you know, beat everything. All the, the adventure mode and all the puzzles and everything like that. Because that is generally what happens when you're playing video games. If you want infinite ammo in Call of Duty, you have to basically 100% the game and uh, all that other shit. You have to collect all the medals and everything else to get infinite ammo. So, yeah, that's an issue because, yeah, I just don't, I don't like that. I mean, because by that time, you, uh, don't have a need to play the game much anymore once you've already beaten the game and 100 percent of it, in other words, did everything that you possibly could, you don't want to do it again. I mean, unless you want to make videos, like if you want to do a walkthrough on the game like I'm doing right here. I mean, I'm doing it regardless. Hey, shovel! Yay! And you are about to see a crazy person in the next part. Okay, so. Okay. With that, I hope if you like this video, give this video a like. If not, that's fine too. Don't forget to comment down below your thoughts on the whole damn thing. And don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon down below to get notified of my future uploads and live streams. Whatever the fuck else I do, I will be playing Plants vs. Zombies a lot. So that's something to expect. I, I, uh, I got a new computer recently, so uh, why not use it on Plants vs. Zombies and other games so I can have at least the best HD quality videos. And I, I think it uploads slightly faster than it does on the Windows 10 computer. I think. Anyways... As always, I will see you on the next video. Peace out, people, and bro hoof.